gonna be good, man. Um, I, um, before we close this evening, I would like to discuss something. I have lived in Long Beach for the last couple of years. It has been the best couple of years of my life. I, I just have to say that we live in, we live in, in troubling times, tumultuous times. I'm not going to say any more than that in terms of that, but I got to tell you that there is so much I've loved about living in Long Beach in the last couple of years. You know, I didn't grow up here, obviously. I grew up in Queens, so, you know, and there are many parts of this place that remind me of Queens so much, but, you know, I think that Long Beach is definitely one of the best places to live in Long, in Long Island, especially during the summertime. I mean, summer's almost here. Memorial Day weekend is afoot. And um, I've known this myself because I've worked on the beach um, a good couple of summers. And the, 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 the experience you have in this town is just unbelievable. And, you know, the things you get to do, you get to go on the boardwalk, you get to, you know, be on the most amazing beaches, very clean beaches. You know, the, the people that do the beach, you know, the, the hard, very hardworking people that, that put the beach together for everybody. And, you know, you get amazing tourists and stuff, you know, people come down from all over the place, all over the city, all over the world even, you know, like, it's just, I love Long Beach so much, and I think that people need to appreciate what we have here, you know, people who grew up here, we, we, there's, this, you live in one of the best places in the country, I've heard that it's actually one of the safest places in the entire United States, like, like, literally, like, the top 100, I, I, I have, um, I, I don't have the stats right off my head, but I, I they're, they're there, I'm telling you. But, um, but no, you have to, this is a blessing to live here, and I am so blessed to live here, and I hope everybody, my wish is for everybody to have like the best summer possible. You only have one life, and you have to live your life. You have to go to the beach, you have to, you know, you have to shred the waves, like Dane says. You have to, um, you know, you have to go out, you gotta go to the restaurants, go to the, the bars, go to places like Minnesota's, or Beach House, or the Inn, or... You know, I mean, this is a special place here. Like, people, it's like a rite of passage to do all these things in Long Beach, you know, just for the residents. But, you know, just to be here is just, it's just an incredible feeling. I just feel like, you know, I mean, like I said, time is short. You have to live your life. And you just got to be thankful for everything you have. And I am thankful for everything I have. I want everybody to enjoy, go out there, ride their bikes or walk or just enjoy. Take a little moment of their time to just appreciate what you have here. You know, because not everybody's going to have that experience, you know. I mean, you have an, you know, play, what you experience here is something that you will have for the rest of your lives, you know. And I've heard so many stories from people in this town that have had amazing memories. And I want people to keep having those amazing memories. Because, like I said, you know, life can, only, so much can happen in life, you know. And, um, but um, I think that's it on my hand. If anyone wants to add anything, now's the time. Yeah. Yes, Rocco, you're, you're, you're completely right about Long Beach. It's really just a great thing. I actually was born in Florida, and uh, I left Florida, and I came up here to Long Beach, and my, my mom, she just, we moved together, and I came up here, and I was so amazed on how, how much of a great community it is, really. I, I've learned so much about the community. I've met so many great people throughout the community. I know everyone from the West End, East End, Middle, Lido. It's just great. You have diversity here. You have the rec center, which is a great place. Football, skateboarding, you have the beach, as Rocco mentioned, the West End restaurants, and Lido for the beaches again. But I just want to say that it's a it's a great place. So back to Rocco. Anybody want to add anything else? No. 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 What about uh, my cameraman, Christine? You want to say anything? <laughs> okay, sure. Well, I also wish everybody um, to have a really amazing summer. 2015 is almost here. Get out and enjoy it, like Rocco said. I actually took a um, stand-up paddleboard last summer and learned to surf so i'm so excited to have dane here because we're going to talk a lot about this because yes the waves don't look go so good this week <laughs> but um get out there enjoy it with your friends and family patronize our businesses get on the beaches and enjoy our town because we're very blessed to be able to live on this very beautiful barrier island and i certainly say thanks thank you god every day that i could be a part of it so back to you rocco um, I just want to close with, I want to thank my, my parents, my wonderful parents who have done everything for me, my step-parents. I, I want to thank everybody in Long Beach that I've ever befriended in my life. You will mean the world to me, and I'm very honored to be part of your town and to represent this town as part of the show. So we're going to close up, and I'm going to wrap it up in pure how, Halftime Howie style. We filled in for halftime. I want to thank you for your time. Just join us next Sunday night.
for another edition of Halftime, but this time we're out of time. See you next Sunday!